Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your daily vibes for November 8th into the 9th. Keep in mind, this is an energy that I'm picking up on today. It might not be for you. It could be. You never know. And the timing is fluid. We just don't know. We just don't know. Sorry, that was crooked. Uh, yeah. So I am a Virgo rising. Uh, very much like things just so... Just so I know. Anyway, um, I don't know why I just had to fix that. But uh, anyway, this is a this is a um, daily energy for today, or whenever it resonates with you. Ah, uh, something is not moving the way it should. Blocked, stalled. Somebody's not finding the discipline or there's a loss of willpower or something. Not going in the right direction. Definitely not. Definitely not. Somebody is, is staying in a situation that is not going to lead to victory and success. They need to find their strength to make a move, to cross that bridge into the new beginning, whatever, but they're not doing it. Okay? Somebody's just not doing it. Being dishonest with themselves. Not finding the power. Not communicating clearly and not seeing the situation. Seeing the situation clearly. It's like refusing to wake up or refusing to do the right thing. Somebody is in like... I can't do it mode. I just can't do it. Well, they're not thinking clearly. It's not practical. Stubbornly holding on to something seriously. It's not stable and secure, whatever it is. Somebody's lying to themselves about something. Because they don't have mental strength to make a move. Weak. We have a weak individual here who is in denial about something. Huh. <laughs> wow. Not prepared. Just not prepared to bring victory and success to your life at this time. You're not seeing the opportunities. Or you're being blinded to the opportunities. Oh my goodness gracious. Wow. So we have a person that needs to cross the bridge. It's, it is a shaky bridge, you know, but you got to do it. You're going to have to find the strength to do so to bring victory and success. We have Cancer, we have Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. So I don't know if you're dealing with those people, but we have somebody here that's just not accepting the reality of a situation. And it could be any sign, it doesn't really matter. It's probably the woman, okay? We have the woman here, a woman that's not accepting reality. That a man or whoever, somebody is not headed in their direction. And it's time to wake up, but I don't want to wake up. Please, I don't want to wake up. I don't want to cross that bridge. Because right now, you know, this is what I know. But I'm telling you what. You have another opportunity waiting. But being in denial and refusing to wake up... <laughs> I don't know. See, I told you you had another opportunity. For all of you people that are in absolute, 100%, positively denial, because that's what you're in. There's a new opportunity for love. This is not the person that you think is going to come back. It's not. This is somebody new. An unexpected person that 
doesn't fit your stereotype, you know, that you usually go for. This is a perfect match that is waiting to come into your life and may enter your life at this time. But you may not even see the opportunity because you're focused on some sort of lie of some sort, you know, denial, denial. Refusing to cross that bridge into the unknown and let this new opportunity come to you, this perfect opportunity. Because you think that whoever it is that isn't communicating with you, that isn't moving in your direction, you know, <laughs> is the best bet. Well, that's not the best bet. You're not thinking clearly. You're not being real. If you're dealing with a person that doesn't communicate with you, you don't have self-respect. There's a relationship that has ended and somebody is refusing to accept it. Refusing. You know, that's the name of the game, right? And there's an opportunity for a new relationship with a perfect max, match. But you have to make a choice. And this is a card of consequences. You will have to live with the consequences of your choice. If you continue, continue to stay in a situation that is not real, okay? It's un... It's whatever. There's no truth in it, you know, whatever it is, they're missing opportunities, there's no victory. If you continue to stay there, then hey, you won't get this this connection that you deserve that's going to bring balance to your life, that's going to make you feel so good. You won't get that. You won't get that. But you have to make a choice. This is a card of choice. It really is. You have that choice, whether you want to cross that bridge into the unknown and have a happy relationship with somebody, or do you want to keep pretending that somebody that's not coming back is coming back, okay? Not happening. You need to open your heart. Open your heart to new opportunities. Because you deserve it. You deserve it. You deserve it. Reciprocation. And it's time to start fresh. To leave the past behind. This fool goes on his journey without the past. He brings very little with him. It's a fresh start from zero. Zero is before one. We are going to start at zero. And this is a brand new beginning. And it's not with who you think it is. And a lot of you are in such denial. That you're going to continue to suffer. Because you are. You don't have the discipline and the willpower. To find your self respect. We have a new beginning here waiting. And if you see these two are mirroring each other with somebody brand new, brand new. It's a it's a soulmate connection. But you have to move on from where you're at. This is the six of you have to, you have to, you have to. Right now, you have an opportunity. For those of you that are stuck in denial, refusing to accept the truth about a love interest that's not communicating, not heading in your direction, for those of you that are afraid to cross that bridge, if you move on, there is a new opportunity waiting for you, like, right away. For those of you that have moved on, there's a new opportunity here. Somebody brand new. And it could lead to a relationship. It could. A happy relationship but you're gonna have to open your heart and you're gonna have to put in effort and you're gonna have to be be able to take a risk and you're being called to take a risk on this new opportunity have faith because 
There's a passionate new partner here. Passionate new N-E-W. For all of you that didn't hear that, new, new, new. This is a new partnership, brand new. Because where you're at, <laughs> whatever it is you're being unrealistic about, it's done, it's over, it's not compatible. It's not. There's no union coming in from that direction. And you have another opportunity. But you got to be real. And you're not being real by holding on to some fake ass shit. And therefore, you know, if you don't take any action, then you have to live with that consequence of living alone, being alone, right? somebody you know is wanting to head into your life and they probably are headed into your life and there's an opportunity for a passionate new beginning a fresh new start with somebody brand spanking new but you have to see it as a valid opportunity and stop being blinded by what you once knew somebody is holding on to a dead end situation it's over it's getting old it's gone on for too long it's time to release it and all you can do is just you know, you've been staying stuck sacrificing yourself for no reason whatsoever you could be dealing with a Pisces who or anybody that can't get out of their head Back and forth, back and forth. They don't know what they want, whoever this person is. And it even could be you. Somebody doesn't know what the hell they want. And they don't want to face the struggle of letting go. So today is a day about ma of making a choice. That's what this is about. You have to make a choice in regards to moving on to a new passionate partnership, a new passionate beginning. You need to be uh, able to take a risk and fall in love because there's an opportunity to fall in love with somebody that you didn't expect. It's not who you think it is. Okay? It's not. In order to have this loving connection, you are going to have to move on from whatever is holding you back. From the relationship that's done, you have to move on for real. You have to stop holding on to the, to the dead end. And you need to be able to just say, you know what, I'm ready to start over with someone new. So yes, there's an opportunity for a new beginning for those of you that are seeing things clearly. But we have the majority here, not all, that is not seeing things clearly. I'm telling you what, hanging on to this lie is not going to bring you victory and success. You have to find that mental strength within you to move on from that relationship. Okay? Mental strength is lacking to move on from that relationship that is dead. You have a new opportunity for love, but you're going to have to cross that bridge and stop lying to yourself because you're not seeing things clearly. You're not being realistic. Stubborn, stubborn. It's time to take a risk on new love because whatever it is that you're holding on to stubbornly is not compatible. And it's time to wake up.
And that's what I have. Let's get an oracle card. Why don't we? Why don't we? What deck? Oh, I guess we got this one. There's an opportunity for new love here. Are you wise enough to accept it? Or are you weak? Somebody's weak. <laughs> That's the truth. The chariot reversed. Somebody is weak. And you deserve, with the six of coins, you deserve reciprocation. You deserve to be loved. Receive with love and appreciation. Receiving something lovingly from others is a way of showing love. Somebody is going to give you what you deserve if you allow it. So yes, there is an opportunity for somebody to enter your life and it's and it's probably there's probably going to be an instant connection. And it's probably going to take you by surprise. And you're going to have to make cuz there's a decision, a choice here. Are, are you ready? Are you ready to move on from whoever this person is that you've been in denial about because now you have this new connection looking you in the face it's so instant okay it is there's an instant connection here and it's and there's room for a lot of growth you're gonna have to make a choice between two there's no doubt there's no doubt it's time to move on from the person for real that is not reciprocating because you deserve it. There's no need to hang around for somebody that can't get out of their head and can't communicate because you have somebody here that is going to love you and reciprocate. Walk over that bridge, get to the other side and burn that son of a bitch. Good luck.